I think that if you're trying to reshape or shape the image of a huge multi-billion dollar league and corporation, which is what they are, a business, I think that sending Roger Goodell out there to be booed mercilessly every single time on a night that millions of people are watching is a bad idea. I, I, it, it's you don't gone like the optics. Being cute. I don't like the optics. Right. I don't like the optics. I, I think you're sending them out there. You're reminding people who might not already know and might not live in it moment by moment that everybody hates him. Whether it's justified or not right. is, is a completely separate discussion. So who does it then? But you have to send him out Somebody at least once. That's that's going to happen. He He's the commissioner of the NFL. So at some point, you have to send him out there. I think you... Be, you're strategic about when you do it, and then you let him stay away from the stage the rest of the I'm going to make way. a suggestion. This is a show. It's all, the, it's all it is is a show now. Why doesn't it have a host? And the Oscars has a host. The ESPYs has a host. Why do you need the commissioner to announce all these picks? So, Jalen, you and I put our heads together, and we came up with it. Who should host the NFL draft? Dwayne The Rock Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa. So, just right out the blue. I'm dead yeah. serious. Yeah, that's, he he's a there, former huh? collegiate football player. He's an A-list celebrity, and he will handle himself with class. The hey, whole NFL. thing, though, that's a long game. Hey, NFL, please don't continue to allow this. You're making really? a mockery of your draft. I'm serious. As somebody that's walked on the stage and had the opportunity in a red and white suit, as a matter of fact, it was yeah, fire too, though. Red Gators, appreciate you. It was fire. To shake David Stern's hand, you dumbing, you dumbing it down. You cheapening your product by doing this. I know it's funny, I cute didn't see that. when people have their little things like David Akers did. I liked it. I laughed, and it's all fun. But here's the thing. David Akers also was getting booed by the crowd right. because he was egging them on. Right. So now what ends up happening like is match. every time you go to another town, you're going to egg on the hometown and have yeah. them booing you like they're booing the commissioner. That is all bad. No, it's not. It's WWE. That's not bad. That's great. The crowd's into it. It's worse if it's the crowd's quiet and you hear nothing. When, then they're just When, when the last time you've been to a WWE draft? Well, they actually do have drafts. They split up the two two nights, Mondays and Tuesdays, and they split them up. Correct. The thing is Correct. that they don't want to be. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I was, okay. I was waiting on it. Okay. We were waiting for you got, to finish I, that. I, I, I got you on that one. They I do. Like SmackDown and Raw. 